Um, today, the state drought, drought conditions. We hear about the drought all the time, but um, every Thursday we update uh, the drought expectations and where the status, if you will, across the state. And uh, as we unfortunately had to update today, our, our, conditions, conti our conditions continue to worsen. Uh, now 20% of the state of New Hampshire is in what is classified as extreme drought status, uh, with 95% in what we call severe drought status. So in response, um, I've talked to a lot of folks, uh, individual citizens, that their wells are going dry. They're having trouble actually getting water uh, from their, their traditional water sources. So in response, earlier today I spoke with Senator Morse, um, Senator Morse from Salem, who is in charge of the New Hampshire Drinking Water and Groundwater Trust Fund. Um, Chuck Morse has done a great job and he's really led the biggest clean drinking water investments in the state's history uh, over the past two years. They've done a phenomenal job. Uh, he and I spoke about helping the citizens who are facing these challenges as their wells dry up. And so in working with Senator Morris, I'm going to formally ask Commissioner Bob Scott of the Department of Environmental Services uh, to submit a formal request to that Drinking Water Commission to set up an emergency trust fund uh, to help create new water wells and new resources for some of our, our hardest hit citizens. It's, um, I was out a lot this past week talking to businesses and homeowners. Uh, I was up in Warren, uh, the town, small town of Warren, beautiful town by the way. Uh, I was up there and a lot of their wells are simply dry. Um, dug wells have to be turned into drilled wells. That can cost a lot of money, thousands and thousands of dollars to make that opportunity happen. Uh, but we do have money in our Clean Drinking Water Trust Fund that uh, Chuck has led the, the, the efforts on. And so we're going to ask for some of those dollars to be moved to an emergency fund um, so we can just open up the opportunity for some of those citizens to redig or redrill their wells and making sure that clean drinking water is available to everyone in the state of New Hampshire.